Hello everybody. Today we're going to take a look at a very famous place that's located in Clearwater, Florida. It has a lot of history. It's a place that was known as the Kapok Tree Inn, gardens and restaurant. And then it went out of business in the 90s and then turned into Thoroughbred Music Store. And then it turned into Sam Ash Music. And now Sam Ash has gone out of business as well. And the buildings has seen better days. So we're going to take a look at the, the building, the exterior of the building today. So this here was the parking for the Kapok tree. In addition to the area behind the fence here was also parking for the Kapok tree. And then when they brought in the music store, they didn't need as much parking, sold that off. And this is all that remained of the parking. There's a lot of attention to detail when they built this place, including beautiful architecture, even on something as simple as a wall. This area over here is the gardens. It is currently used still as a special events area for weddings and large catered events. It's currently locked up, but we'll take a peek through the, the fence here. This here is the gardens, the east side. There's like a pond and a fountain way in the back corner there. Go through there. All right, here's another view of the gardens here. You can see through here, this was all fountains through here. We'd be looking through waterfalls. All right, moving farther down this wall of the gardens. See in the gardens there's more statues. These are the fountains over here. Fountains over here, and this would be another way to get in here. And back way in the distance is one of the dining rooms that was open to the public in the 90s, 80s, 70s. Alright, one last view into the fountains area. All right, one last look at the area where the gardens are. They're all behind these bushes and this fancy wall. We've got decorative pots up there. The fountains were all below that area. This was the east entrance into the gardens. And to my knowledge, this would be the creator of this facility, which was, I believe, named Bum Gardner, Mr. Bum Gardner. Unfortunately, the place is in disrepair now. We're gonna go focus on the building now. This would be the gift shops, and there are some restaurants kind of in this building as well on the, on the back side. This is also where the music store entrance was. It's right over here. This still continuing was all the music store in recent times. This is where everybody was dropped off and waited for the rides at the benches here. This is always the main entrance into the facility. Take one more quick look around here. 
notice these large columns here. Estimated probably about 20 feet tall. We're now going to head to the gardens that are facing McMullen Booth Road. And this is currently the most famous thing related to the restaurant. This is the Kapok tree massive tree. Up until about the mid-2000s there were fountains here, walkways, statues, planters. It was all in disrepair and was pulled out. Would have been another fountain back in the day. This is the dining room over here. This was the kitchen, back of the kitchen area. Maintenance. Loading dock. And now you're into the back of the gardens. And then this brings you directly into a neighborhood. All right, we're on another street in the neighborhood and this is the employee parking lot. This used to have a fence at one point between these columns. And there's the restaurant loading dock you can see in the background. So that's a tour of the once what was the K-pop tree in of Clearwater, Florida, Sam Ash music, and Thoroughbred music. Thanks for watching, everybody.